A very good afternoon. My name is Stuart Merlis. I'm an applications engineer here at Pico Technology. And this afternoon, I wanted to show you one of the demonstrations that we've been doing here in Nuremberg. I'll be illustrating um, the usefulness of TDR and TDT analysis. I'm going to show you around my, my setup. I've, uh, as you'll see, I've got the positive output of my step recovery diode, which can be set from zero and in incremental up to seven volts. You will notice here I've got a resistive power divider and I'm feeding this into the channel of the sampler module. Coming from the other side of my splitter, I'm going into my device under test. This PCB is, has on it a stepped impedance line. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna have a look at the difference in characteristic impedance as we go along this track, down this part of the track and out to the terminated load on the end. Taking you into the software of Pico Samples uh, 3, you'll see that I've uh, ready set up for a TDR measurement. You'll notice as I go into my measurement, uh, we are set at 50 uh, ohms. As I move along with my markers, my tracking markers, you can see there's a drop in impedance. If I show you now that, that there is a change from 50 ohms down to 25 ohms and then back into 50 ohms. TDR is very useful for looking at um, faults in, in, in characteristic impedance and it's a very good visualization from distance to fault. Pico Technology has a wide range of solutions that can help with TDR and thank you very much.